Okay, so I went Saturday night to CVS to do the deals. Um, the first thing was a continuation of last week. This is the Tide Pods, and they were on sale for $3.94, and I had a $2 coupon off of that, so it just made it $1.94, so I just wanted to get that. This is everything that I got in my first transaction. Again, it didn't work out as planned because I didn't have everything, but um, Pretty much everything here is whatever you get, you're going to get the extra care bucks back with a little bit of difference. Like the Listerine was $2.99 and you get $2 back on the Listerine. The Five Gum was $1 and you get back $1. The Snickers was $0.79 cents and you get back the $0.79. Cents. The Green Giant, you can get the um, corn or you can get the green beans. They were $0.99 cents and you get back $0.99. Cents. The Advil, that was a pain in the butt to find in the store. Um, that was hanging in one of the aisles. It took me forever to find that. And those are a pork count for 99 cents. And you get the 99 cents back there. The macaroni and cheese, again, 99 cents, get back 99 cents. And then these last four items were the four items that didn't come up as planned because um, apparently there's a sale from this current week and that one still runs over until tomorrow. So. I did have to go back into the store and he did some price modifications and things like that in order to get the deal that it was supposed to be. So the combos was supposed to be $1.50 and you get back $1.50. Mine rang up at $2.67 so he had to do a refund on that and then go ahead and price change it and give me the extra care books back for that. The Gear Gardettos and it's also the Chex Mix. That's supposed to be um, $1.99 and then you get back $1. That ended up coming up to be um, $1.50 actually. So um, he just ended up giving me the um, dollar, what was it supposed to be back? The dollar back on that. He didn't change the price or anything like that. The Sour Patch Candy, I'm sorry. The, one or the other, the gum was $1.57, you get back $1.57 and the candy was supposed to be $1.67 getting back 167 but the candy rang up as um, sour patch a dollar 19 um, and he just went ahead and gave me the extra care bucks back for that as well and the Hershey's was the same 79 cents sorry about the lighting it is dark I don't know what time it is 10 11 I don't know sometime at night and I just wanted to record this now so that I can get it up by the morning the next one over here, oh, let me show you the receipt here. All right, so I have two receipts here. Again, he had to price modify it, so um, I'm not gonna go through the whole receipt, but if you wanted to take a look at it, you can kind of pause it and um, see what's up with the receipt and everything. Um, and I had $10 from a survey that I did from CBS, $10 extra care buck, and I had a $5 beauty buck. So that's what I used there. And then all together, I ended up getting back $13.85 in this transaction in extra care bucks. The total was about $17.06 and I, and again, I got back $13.85. It was supposed to get back $14.29, but you know, whatever, it was like a dollar off, no big deal. This next one here, the physician's formula, the big beauty sale is starting, I guess, um, Physicians for me, there's a few things, some bronzers and that powder right there, 75% off. They're originally $14 and some change. It came out to be $3.62. I had a $3 extra care, not extra care buck, a $3 CVS coupon for Physicians Formula, which I used, so I paid $0.62 cents for that. The Colgate is $2.99. There is a $0.75 cent printable coupon from the Colgate website that you can use. So that'll bring it down to um, $2 and 20 something cents, whatever it is. Tomorrow in the red box, you're gonna get a $2 and 49 cents extra uh, CVS coupon coming out of the box. So that will make it like a little tiny money maker. The Robitussin Med Smoothers, those were a pain in the butt to find as well. They were on the end caps of the aisles. Um, this is the four count. So um, they have the 10 or 12 count. I think it's a 12 count in the aisle but you have to search for these, so good luck on finding them. It was not easy. So the four count right there, those are $1.49, and you get back the $1.49 right there. 
the CVS baby wipes are 99 cents, you get back 99 cents. The vitamin water is supposed to be $1.50 and you get back $1.50. They're actually on sale this week for 99 cents. So um, he went ahead and gave me the extra care bucks anyway. The double shot espresso from Starbucks is $1.50 and you get back $1.50. And then the CVS um, panty liners are supposed to be 99 cents and um, you get back 99 cents. Mine rang up a little bit more. They rang up at a dollar and 27 cents. So he did have to price modify that and do a return and et cetera and all that nonsense. Um, but he ended up uh, giving me some extra care bucks back for the things that were on different sales. I got back about almost $8 in extra care bucks and I ended up using $8.85 in extra care bucks and that was from the previous transaction. Um, so here is the receipt. Again, I'm not gonna go through the receipt on this one, um, but if you wanted to, you can kind of pause it and look at it and see the prices. But again, remember a couple things here, he had to price modify and do a refund, um, which was for that one. Um, those are all the extra care bucks that I used as a 75 cent Colgate coupon, the $3 physician's formula, and then everything else was extra care bucks from the previous transaction. So I paid 96 cents out of pocket for those items right there. All right, you guys, so that is everything for my CVS. I do plan on going back today. For me, it's tomorrow which will be Sunday today for you, maybe, if you're watching it. I don't know when you're watching this, um, but pretty good. I didn't really come out of my pocket anything. I had $15 in extra care bucks. So I started off with $15 in extra care bucks, and I ended up with just under $15 in extra care bucks again. So um, I do plan on going back and looking in another CVS to see if they have the other items that this particular CVS did not have. Um, a few of the items here you can do more than once. Um, I can tell you the Listerine, you can do it one more time. And also the Robitussin uh, Med Smoothers, you can do that one one more time as well. Um, I think everything else is only once per card. So I'm gonna go ahead and go over the list that I have um, that way you can kind of see the deals that I kind of wrote down and picked out that was going to be the good deals so um, I kind of broke it down for myself by looking at the CVS ad um, everything here on this first page on this page here up to this point here is um, the CVS it's Sunday to Wednesday and then this one here is Thursday to Saturday so I kind of broke it down to um, the yellow was gonna be one transaction up to $15 worth of items. The purple was gonna be another transaction that was up to $15 of items as well. These were my optional things that I was contemplating on doing. Um, and then the Tricom was gonna be separate because it was $9.99. So um, if you wanna kinda of see what I kind of wrote down, um, these are the items and how much you were going to pay and how much you're going to get back based on what the sale said. So this is the Total Home Detergent, the Macaroni and Cheese, the Green Giant, um, the Kraft Parmesan is um, $3.99 and you get back $3.00. Um, I did not do that one, but I do plan on going back and getting it probably. The Hershey's Chocolate, the Sour Patch Gum, um, the Snickers, Five Gum. Uh, this is the combos, $1.50, you get back $1.50. The Vita Water, you get back the $1.50. Um, this is the Starbucks Double Shot, the Sour Patch Candy. Um, these were the optional things, the Revlon Nail, $4.99, you get back $3. I think tomorrow you're going to get a $2 extra care, um, CVS coupon that's going to come out of the red box, so that's going to be really good. You'll get it for $1. The Revlon Lip, you're going to end up paying $2.99 for that. Um, Chex Mix, $1.99, you get back a dollar, so you're coming out 99 cents. The Advil, you get back exactly the same. The CVS Pen Aligner is the same. The Tricom, my store did not have it. I did want to get that. Um, it's $9.99, and you get $9.99 back. Um, the CVS Wipes, 
uh, the baby wipes, the 20 count, it was 99 cents, get back 99 cents, and then the Robitussin Med Smoothers, four count. Um, there were a couple other items over here. I actually made the list at work and I left it at work. So thankfully I took a picture of it so I was able to see it. Um, there was a few more deals there. I don't know what it was. Um, my store did not have the rescue gum so I'm going to check out another one tomorrow. Um, this is some kind of um, headache migraine medication. It's like a little tiny pack for 99 cents. Um, the CVS trainers, I did not get that for 99 cents because I don't need it. And then the Colgate Total. Um, again, I told you it was going to be $2.99. Um, you're going to get a $2.49 uh, $2 CVS printable coupon. And um, you can print out the $0.75 cent coupon online. Um, actually, this is the coupon that you, you can print out online and use it um, for tomorrow. Go to the Colgate website. So if you're interested in next, the next ad, it's for 1127 until 1129, starts on Thursday. Um, these are just a couple things that I saw that I was probably going to be getting. So the Viva paper towels, $1.99, the Orbit gum, the gum toothbrush, $2, get back $2. The Bumblebee tuna was just a good deal at 66 cents a can. Um, and that's for the white tuna CVS uh, batteries, the double A and the triple A, they're going to be four nineteen. You get back for back four nineteen. The Reese's candies, Nick slip, and the Revlon nail color again, four ninety nine. You're going to get back three dollars. Um, so I think you could probably do that twice because it runs over to both weeks, or both ads during the week. So. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully um, this is going to help you out for your Sunday deal. I hope this helped you guys out. And uh, yeah, good luck on the Black Friday deals at CVS. I'll see you again in another video. Bye.